Humans, from their very origins, have always been brutal and always enjoy of magical thinking, and the latest archaeological discovery in Brazil shows both these elements, Margaret. This is crazy. These guys went to Brazil, this place called Lapa do Santo, it's a rock shelter, and they found evidence of the very first Decapit person that was decapitated in history. This is dated 9,000 years old. They found this skull and two hands, both chopped. They found the marks of the cutting in the back of the neck, in the jaw. And they think that this, it was part of a ceremonial aspect because they had an arrangement, a very particular arrangement, and we have a picture of it, um, of the hands on top of the face. They were misplaced. They were misplaced. They were well, I think more than misplaced, they were very carefully placed in such a way. Um, were the hands covering up the they face? They were covering the face, but the right hand was on the left side, and the left hand was on the right side and upside down. Okay. So there was some thinking into it. They are trying to think, determine you know, why they determine did why. This. The first hypothesis is this was type of uh, memorial situation where they're exploring the idea of preserving your forefathers or your uh, ancestors, which is pretty crazy. But to imagine that humans have been decapitating others for the last... 10,000 years I mean, or 9,000 years. That's not shocking. It's, I mean, the first crazy. murder didn't, I mean, in well, every, it's in, in it's every, in it's handed scripture. down in every, you know, that's not, that's not surprising. It's, life is brutal, man. It is, it is. And we've done it, it for thousands been. of years. <laughs> uh, but the cool thing is all the research that went into it, after that, they decided to figure out if this guy was actually from there or was someone that came from outside. They did uh, research very in incredible with isotopes. They find out the combination of isotopes in the remains. Mm -hmm. And with those overlapping circles, they know where do they belong, which groups they might be belong. And this one was right in the intersection of those who are in that area in, in Lapa do Santo. And so they know that it was part of this tribe and it you know, matches with the other findings that they've done and the other burial sites in the area. So they're developing this whole map of this culture and, and trying mm -hmm. to see what is the significance of decapitating and arranging, you know, because it was a hole just with the skull. The rest of the body was not found. So that was one of the, Ooh. that was one of part of the discovery that was like, okay, what, what are we up to here? Because mm -hmm. they couldn't find the rest of the body it was just the skull and the hands. Pretty crazy, but I love this archeological uh, findings. I hope you do too. Let us know your opinion down below in the comments. And if you haven't, please subscribe to the Lib TV.